Week two. Now, this week and next week, we're going to go into systems. This concept of systems thinking. Now, what's a system? A system is a highly integrated set of parts that were organized and integrated to accomplish a specific task. And I made the case that systems could be tangible and systems could be intangible. I don't know. It's just what we do around here. But if you were going to try to be an effective leader, that you had to have great systems. Now, sometimes systems are tangible, right? The system that we, we use to maintain the gymnasium floor. And we use certain kind of machinery and we use certain kind of chemicals and we do it a certain number of times in the year and tangible. But sometimes systems are intangible, like the system that I use to organize my time or the system that I use to delegate or motivate other people. Make no mistake, Archimedes was right that without systems to force multiply what we have, we're probably not going to be highly successful. And he proved that with his fulcrum and lever. And he proved that with his compound pulley. Because through his fulcrum and lever, a man could lift a rock that was 10 times, 15 times, 20 times, 50 times his weight. With the compound pulley, one person could do the work of 10 men. So what are the systems you're utilizing to lead? And what systems is your department or your subgroup or your little crew of five using to get things done? Drucker was right when he said that 85% of the problems we have in the workplace are usually systems-based. It's a bad system. Are the systems you're using what the times require? So check out the systems that we posted, and we'll post more next week. Systems thinking. If I can get you to look around and recognize systems, evaluate if they're still relevant, meaningful, and impactful systems. If they are, awesome. If they're not, if I can get you then to tweak them to make them better, systems have an exponential impact, good or bad. Systems are force multipliers, good or bad. If I can get you to be a better systems thinker, then you'll build a better department. And if you build it a better department, you'll have a better municipality. You have a better municipality will lighten the burden of the citizens of your town. Thank you for all you do, and we'll talk to you again soon. Take care, everybody.